Hi you guys and welcome back to my channel. Here I am again with my hair all messed up, never done, like always, in every video. And it's okay, you know, I'm just living my life, living my best life. So I'm happy I'm able to do this video for you guys today because I've been wanting to do it for a while. Um, in today's video, we are going to be discussing boxy looks versus boxy charm and that way you guys can see for yourself if you want to um sign up for their subscription and see if you want to spend the extra money on the boxy looks so you're gonna see it for yourself and um yeah just keep on watching so first things first boxy charm 25 dollars a month it did go up but Still, I feel like it's a good deal for the amount of products you're getting, the brands that you're getting, and it's full-size products, so I'm not complaining. Uh, Boxy Lux, the other hand, um, is $49.99, but Boxy Charm, you get charged every month, $25. Boxy Lux is only every three months, so you're only paying the extra, I think it's like $24.99 every three months on top of the $25. So it's not every month you're paying 50 bucks, which is good. You know, it's every three months. And I mean, I love BoxyCharm. I canceled Ipsy, like Ipsy was not cutting it for me. And thanks to BoxyCharm, I swear to you, my makeup collection has grown. I have saved so much money on makeup I used to be stupid and spend $200, $300 at Ulta every month. And I wish I knew about BoxyCharm earlier. Because now, thanks to them, I have drawers full of makeup. Which I can show you guys. And the only thing I ever have to really buy is foundation. Or sometimes mascara. But I get pretty lucky when I'm out. I end up getting a mascara. Um, but yeah, like... And now, actually, I think next month I'm getting the foundation, so I'm really excited. So I'm going to show you guys the difference. You ready? Bam, bam, bam. So this big box is the Boxy Lux, and this little box is the Boxy Turn. So as you can see already, the difference in sizes of the box, and you obviously can't feel the weight. But there's definitely a big weight difference. Check that out. Check that out. Like, boom. Um, so this one was from December. I've been not using any of these products because I really wanted to do the video first before I use anything and put it away. Um, so this was a December Boxy Lux. This one was um January's Boxy Charm. So let's start off with how do we start off with the small box so this is what i got in january because if you want to um sign up you know this is 25 dollars a month you don't have to do the boxy list if you want to try it i will have a link on the bottom and please use my code i appreciate it um but yeah let me show you so when you open it Get that, it has the little nice protector here. And you always get a card of um, their theme, the names of the products and description and prices. So January's was breaking the ice. So the first thing I got was from Skin in Cone. And this is a face gumash. So it's a polishing micro exfoliating truffle face gamash and this was made in italy so i'm like eh, fancy um and i'll tell you guys the prices and you know on this guy it's 20 dollars, and this is a delicate exfoliating cream um with a rich texture and soothing fragrance truffle therapy face Gumash is a lush formula combining the best of the iconic Mediterranean lifestyle and the luxury Italian spa experience. A beauty cabinet staple, the Truffle Therapy Face Gumash features sweet almond oil, gentle apricot seed powder, and our unique and exclusive black winter truffle extract 
which has a high concentration of super oxide dumestes, a powerful free radical. I can't read right now. Scavenger that reduces the signs of aging. So it gently buffs away any race dull like luster skin, revealing a more luminous and healthy complexion. So I'm thinking right now, I might not read the full description on these products for you because I honestly, like, you know, I kind of suck at pronouncing these words. But I'll give you the rundown on what the product does and how much it is because who is really listening to that whole fucking paragraph? I mean, that whole paragraph. Excuse my language. But yeah. And I did try it once and I threw it back in the box because my skin was really dry and I wanted to um, exfoliate. It's a hard word for me to say. And it did leave my skin nice. It was nice and soft and radiant. And I need to use it again because my skin's really dry lately. Like, really dry. So, yeah. Like, let's just get to it. Quit talking. So, the next one, which I forgot I got. It's the Avant Skincare. It's an 8-hour radiance renewal sleeping mask. Oh, shoot. This guy is worth $107. Holy cow. Um, why? Like, I need to know. It's an eight-hour radiance renewing sleeping mask. So to reveal youthful and beautiful skin overnight and help tighten the skin and lessen the appearance of wrinkles and fine lines. Well, this is, I feel like this is one of the most expensive things I got. $107. I'm using this tonight. So I like with... BoxyCharm, you get makeup and you also get um, skincare products, hair care products, and now they're throwing in a little bit different things. So I really, really like it and I appreciate it. So yay for BoxyCharm. Um, the next thing I got was a concealer, undercover concealer for $25. Um, it's from Pretty Vulgar, Vagar, Vulgar, and it's a uh, hydrating, buildable, hidden coverage, and it's infused with vitamin E. So it's going to keep your skin moisturized, but cover up, you know? And I don't really use concealer. Mainly I use concealer for my, my eyelids. So, I mean, there's days where I'll dot it where I have a really ugly zit that makeup ain't going to cover. But I usually buy full coverage foundation, so I don't really use it. The next thing we got here is Baal Mana Kadar Beauty Lip Whip. Never heard of it, but 21 bucks for this guy. And it's a matte lipstick, um, long-lasting pigment that won't dry out your lips. So, you know how usually um, matte lipsticks could dry out your lips? And this one won't. I'm just hearing a lot of noises right now. one's here so they're just the neighbors it's fine um the next one is i've gotten a palette from this company before and it's called ace beauté this one's 34.99 and um i don't know i just like this um brand because their shadows are very vibrant they show up really well they last um very pigmented not chalky, not too powdery. It's just a nice palette. I used their other one. I forgot the name of it, but I was really excited to get this one. Let's check out those colors. I was really happy to get this one because these colors were attracting me, those bright yellows and also like the blues right here. Like it was just like, I want that one. Cause they have different variations of colors. So. That's what's cool. So you get five products every month when you get the regular Boxy Charm. And as you can see, five full size products. And I mean, you can't go wrong for $25. In total, this probably would have ran about, let's see, let's see, well over, it would be around $207. So, 25 bucks and you're saving a shit ton, I mean a whole ton of money. 
Okay, let's get to the big guy that I got last month. Oh, I like it's so heavy. It is. This guy was $49.99. Reminder, only every three months. So you're not paying that much every month. Okay? You guys ready for this? I don't know if you're ready for this. Get a bigger card. <laughs> My head's like on the box. Anyway, big card. Nice description. So, in the boxy Lex, you are getting one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine products. Nine products. And let me tell you, you're going to love it. First things first. Maybe you should set this box down. So distracting, right? You're gonna get your hair, the hair wrap towel. And you guys basically know what it is. I don't have one, and I forgot I had this, so I'm gonna use it tonight when I take a shower and maybe decide to do my hair one day. So that'd be cool. And this one cost eighteen dollars. So it helps reduce frizz. Maintain healthy hair and it cuts your um, blow drying time. So awesome. The next product we hear, ooh, it's a little fancy, huh? And it's by Cosmetics. And this one, what's this one do? It's a facial roller and it's worth $69. So it's to improve the visibility of fine lines, enhance skin texture, and uplift fatigue, which I need because I look really tired. And I am really tired because I worked last night because I'm a stripper, you know? Gotta get up in stripper hours. I'm not a stripper. I have stripper hours. I work stripper hours sometimes. Anyway, this is it. It's pretty heavy. Um, it has little instructions for you on like how to use it. Like you could use it anywhere in your body. Actually, you could do your collarbone, you could do your under thighs. Like there's all kinds of things you could use it for. So that's cool. I feel like it'd be nice. Like I need to do it. Now that I finally show you guys my box, you know, I could really use these products. You know, things I do it for videos. The next one is from Soy Face Cleanser. And it's by Fresh. And this one's $48. It's a gel cleanser. And um, it removes makeup, even mascara, without drying. For soft, supple skin, so that's good. And it has cucumber and balancing rose water. Um, it soothes and tones, so it's good for sensitive skin, which I need. Um, I definitely need hydration. Like, my skin's been horrible. Like, not in breaking out. It's just so dry. Like, so dry in my cheeks. I've been trying so many things. I moisturize twice a day. I put hydrating spray. <sighs> I just, when my skin's dry, it's dry. Like, you can't revive that. Like, it's hard. So, this guy's $48. I do want to open it to see. It's really nice. That's another thing. Another thing that I got is a charcoal um, detox dry shampoo. And this one's from IGK, which I've gotten their products before. I like it. It's hair products. I've had their uh, moisturizing balm. You leave it in. Um, it's a leave-in conditioner. And it works good. I put it on my daughter as well, you know, because, you know, we got to keep our health here nice and healthy. Mm. I guess my hair don't look that bad. It just looks messy. But this one, um... So, when they say detox, so it cleanses um, the oiliest hair and scalp with oil erasing odor, um, eliminating charcoal powder, allowing you to go even longer between washes. So, it's 27 bucks. So, that's cool. Because, honestly, I've heard you shouldn't wash your hair every day. 
but every three days is pretty good. I've known people complain of they have oily hair and I honestly used to have that problem. And what helped me solve that problem is when I went magenta on my hair. Um, I didn't want to wash my hair every day because obviously the color was going to come out and um, I wanted my color to last. So I went on YouTube and found out about dry shampoo. So I started using the very sexy big hair dry shampoo, which is my favorite dry shampoo. Best lightweight. You can't see it. It's really good. I highly recommend it. I haven't tried this one yet, but I will let you guys know about it. And I noticed that me cutting on washes, and it took a long time to get used to it, but I noticed eventually, like, the oils in my hair must, like, um, like, balanced out. Because my hair, like, if I wasn't washing my hair and didn't even put dry shampoo, my hair would not get oily. Like, it doesn't no more. Like, this hair... How many days? It's probably like two days um, since it's been washed. And as you can see, it's not oily. Not at all. And sorry, I keep playing with my hair. Like, I just feel like sometimes the lighting makes me look bald. And I'm feeling like, don't look at me bald spot. You know? But yeah, I'll let you guys know on that. And I don't know if I told you guys the price, but this one's $27 for that. So I hope it works. <laughs> Another thing is I got from Elmas is a Pro Collagen Rose Facial Oil. Um, so it's for fine lines and wrinkles. Um, it soothes, nourishes, and smooths. And this one, should that, is $79. Hey, I can't believe this is the most expensive thing so far. Um, it's a luxurious oil infused with a precious trio of rose extracts to help smooth the look of fine line wrinkles and leaving the skin luminous so let's look at it i've tried their mask before it's pretty nourishing oh, bit of cramp i think it's a little bummer i love face products i like seeing stuff improving my skin what do you guys like the most Face products like creams, cleansers, treatments, masks, or makeup. Like if you had to pick between the two, what would you pick? Let me know in the comments below. I'm really curious. Oh, this one. I got excited with this one because I smelled it already. This guy is a dry oil spray. Um, oh, it smells so good. So they call it beach air and it has per pergamot, citrus, white, jasmine, Brazilian soft wigs, and heliotrope and musk. So this one, what does it do? What does it do? Why can't I read? Oh, it's here it is. So this is worth $36. And um it's a fast absorbing multi-purpose dry oil spray. Um it has high quality oils that quickly penetrate, delivering superior moisture, leaving skin soft and luminous without feeling greasy. And it's for hand and body for extra moisture. So I thought you could use it in your hair. But... Oh yeah, you can. So you could spray massage the oil into your skin, for your hair, onto your palms. Well, it's telling you how to do it for your hair. Um, you could do it on your face. Just put it on your hands and apply it to face where needed. So it, it goes anywhere. That's cool. And I told you it's worth $36. And next we got um, from Sight. Sight. I need to learn how to pronounce these. Um, it's Confetti Highlighter. And this guy is worth um, $32, so it's just a highlighter. Wow. It's cute. Ooh, look through the guy's name. See that? Um, let's open it. I want to see how it looks. Huh. It's different than my other highlighters. It has a lot of different little colors, so let's hands are clean so can you see that 
it's a pretty nice kind of sheer kind of like a rose gold color but maybe more of a gold it's pretty I'll put it right there in my hand i like it it's really soft fluffy um so yeah that one was 32 dollars I'm trying to put everything back just for me to put it away. Okay. Next thing on the list. Is it our last item? Is it? No, we still got more. Wait, let's leave that one for last. We're going to do the lipstick by Too Faced. And it's a High Shine Sparkling Gloss in the color Tonight Stand. A little packaging to do that. And this one's worth $21. Um, comfortable texture with oils. Um, glitters and pearls, which is pretty. Oh, that's really cute. Look at that. This is like the gloss you want to carry in your purse. It's a little hotter. Cute, right? The color is definitely cute. Oops, felt dry so I think. It's just a natural pinky color. Whoa, I look scary like that. Let me stop. But yeah. I'm trying to show you the lip color and I just look like a fool. Anyways, it's a light color. You really see it's just natural and cute like me the last thing we got is this fairy tale storybook came with a book you guys and fairy tales like you're never too old for fairy tales like at all and this book cost 55 dollars <laughs> because it's a palette yes Ooh, let me show you the colors it's pretty cool it is looking like a book. It's really thick. Um, I've never re have I ever tried Storybook Cosmetics? I don't think so. So let's see how it swatches. The blue. This one's called Castle. So the colors are feeling. Um, they're very pigmented. The matte's a little chalky. Um, we got this pink. Ooh, that one was pretty, um, that one was pretty moist, that pink color. Um, do my nail fingers. Hmm. So it seems like it has good color payoff. Let's try another color. Um, let's go in with this guy. So as you can see, the colors are pretty pigmented. <sighs> Let's do this kiss color. See that one felt a little chunky, but it has gold specks of glitter in it. I don't know if you can see that. But um yeah, some are, like some colors are chalky. Like this one is not. Let's see about the silver. Ooh, that's cute. What other color? How many colors is this? It's Twelve. I only have ten fingers, so we're gonna have to swatch it on the side of this. Pretty. And then this last beauty color. Not bad. See how the new. So, yeah, the colors seem to be good. Um, so yeah, that is all, you guys. Um, like I said, I hope this video helped showed you guys really like what you're getting with Boxy Charm versus Boxy Lux. Is it worth spending the extra money? Um, maybe I'll just do a small little short video. Um after this just to show you guys how much my makeup collection grew um i used to have my makeup here in my bathroom 
and I'm sitting on my bathroom floor, but I promise you guys it's super clean. So don't get grossed out. It's the best lighting I have right now, okay? But I went from having I'll say maybe two drawers I moved up to a full nice little um how do I say it? Organizer, makeup organizer that I ordered from Amazon, which I could put the link on that as well when I do that video. I could do it today because I got time. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys like this video and hope you guys got good information and I will see you guys soon. And thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like my video and I appreciate any love I get. Thank you.